Welcome back, coders, to another episode of NBA 2K18. Uh, today, we're going to be continuing this climb to the MVP level, and what we're going to be looking at is the next game that we have on the docket. We're just going to jump right over to it, which would be the Boston game. So let's go ahead and see if we can just jump right to that without exiting the arena. We're just going to walk out, walk right back in, see if there's any post-game stuff from the last game, but I doubt it. Either way, we're going to be diving into that game and try to continue our climb, get more starter minutes, and see what this is all about. Um, really excited to be with you today. We're going to go ahead and start the pregame show, skip all that nonsense, see if we can get right into the action. Hope you guys are all doing well. Make sure that you hit the like button. On the last video, we were aiming for 100 likes. I haven't gotten a chance to see yet if we were able to succeed there, but let's go ahead and set the goal higher. Let's get 110 likes on this video. If we can get that, we will try to continue to bring you more of the series. That'll be a big key here. We want to see as much support as possible on the series so we can know that this is what you want to see. That way, I will play as much of it as possible. Don't worry. I'm going to skip right past that. We're going to try to get right into the action and not delay any longer so this is one of the annoying parts of the game I'll say right here these little tiny unskippable walk-ins half of them don't even have cutscenes you see he didn't say anything to anybody he's not gonna talk to anybody he's literally just gonna say hey do you want to head to the court yes of course I want to head to the court why did I come to the stadium if I didn't want to head to the court like I like that it allows you to go to the menus and stuff like that but just skip right to that Here's a little cutscene. Oh, yoga. This ground is moving. When it stops, right. Yeah. Half room versus my god. That is ridiculous. Let's play some game. Play some basketball. Coming in with my fresh hairstyle, but I need to get some new. Uh, well, as I continue to level up, I'll be able to get some new cool gear and stuff like that. Um, and right now, it's not that exciting looking at my same ass haircut and uh, same ass clothes and shoes. See if I stroke that one. Okay, we're going to go ahead and end shoot around. I only want to make one, make sure that I'm in a rhythm. Once I'm in a rhythm, we're going to go right into the action. We are at the infamous Boston Garden. Not the old one, but the new one. Facing off against... Is it? Oh, I thought that was Ante Kumpo for a second. A really ugly version of him. Uh, uh, but we got Jalen Brown. We got Kyrie Irving. We got Marcus Smarts, Gordon Hayward. Oh, Jalen Brown's not starting. Al Horford. The whole gang. And I got Eric Bledsoe, Devin Booker, Josh Jackson, Marquise Chris, Alex Len. What? I am not starting anymore? They literally benched me again. <gasps> Those bastards benched me. Why the hell would you bench me? Oh, no way. You benched me? Oh, shit. I am so fucking upset. Motherfuckers benched me. What did I do? I won us the game. I had an amazing, I had a really good game too. Dang, he just dribbled until the ref was just like, wow, fine, foul. Bad call. This is bullshit. I am pretty upset. Okay, so this game thinks that Kyrie Irving is way better than he actually is. 28 points, 54% shooting. I'm sorry. Kyrie Irving's amazing. He ain't shooting 54% from the field with the shots he's taking. It's not going to happen. If he does, holy shit, we better uh, we better just trust him on the flat earth thing then. What in the f... No wonder they benched me. I can't even hold on to the ball when they just pass me the ball in rhythm. Oh, I'm a little bit upset about that. I'm just going for it. I don't care if I get a uh, highlight reel done. We're going to get a new new uh, pass up here. Where I can feel the intensity of this uh, Boston Garden. And one. Give me the and one. At least I got a foul. Okay, right off the bat, we're getting to the line. We're trying to get into our rhythm. Oh my god, and I didn't even make that. Holy shit, this game does not want me to be good at basketball. Still shooting 45% for the ceiling for the season and have almost 12 points a game, which is pretty solid considering I'm in my rookie season. 
I want to get that up, especially considering I'm in the five or six minute quarters, I think is what it is. Real short. Not enough time to really get in a rhythm. I'm guarding Gordon Hayward, which is just a bitch. That's not fair. Look at that step back. Brutal. Goes right in. Okay, this might be this might be a little rough, especially because they ain't going to start me. Okay, you're done, Gordon Hayward. Put you in the post. Why isn't that going to go in? Why isn't that going to go in? That was a great... What? Are you seriously going to say that that was contested game? See, the guy was just standing in the general vicinity. He didn't even contest the shot. Got a rebound. That's a big thing. Get the pass up. What the balls, man? Gordon Hayward's defensive player of the year, apparently. Get the hell out of here. He's not even that solid of a defender. He was always Utah Jazz's... Uh, like problem on defense comparatively I mean he was solid enough but he was no like all NBA defender gonna miss that Suns ball good defensive possession nice work I got two turnovers one point and one rebound what a solid beginning to this damn game I'm gonna post him up again now the pass to DJ Oh, I held it too long? Oh, my God. This is going to be rough. Um, he's just going to pull right up, and I can't run fast enough. Jesus. Oh. Damn. I think I'm 1 or 0 oh for 3. Real rough beginning. I cannot believe they benched me. These motherfuckers benched me. We up with Kyrie Irving earlier, and he a bit about Look at his weird beard. It's probably because he believes the earth is flat. You know, they gave him a shitty beard. Out of each other every single night, and you know the team is going to go as hard as we go, as well as the other pieces that we have on the team. But we have to control it from a standpoint that we have to play off each other. Kyrie us I feel like Kyrie talks in circles. This is my biggest also, beef with him. It's not so much what he believes. I don't really mind that he believes that the earth is flat or, or, or thinks that like you should keep an open mind about things. I mean that's fine. But it's the it's the like I don't want to tell you exactly what I feel crap that drives me nuts. And the first quarter is in the books. Second about ready to get underway. When you consider how the Celtics are doing, guys, okay, give me that bucket. Thanks God. He almost stole the ball again. Gordon Hayward should have gotten a foul. I should have gotten a foul on that one. Well, you really like the activity on the defensive end. Outstanding jumping into passing lanes and coming up with steals. Oh, got the rebound. Get it, Wells. Get it, Wells. There we go. I'm getting into a rhythm. We're going to win this game. You better learn that you need to start me. Ain't no putting me on the bench on this crap. Well, that's not a foul and not a me. Okay, good. I was like, I just blocked the crud out of that. It's a bailout call, though. Ref. Okay, and I'm back in. Minutes ago in the second quarter, apparently they didn't want to give me a whole quarter to warm up and get hot. Oh, that was not a good shot. Not a good shot. It's not what I wanted to take. 20% from the field. Shit. The one thing about this game is you literally can't hit shots like that. Like, not even, like, with a miracle or anything like that. It's not how the game works. It won't let you. Oh, I did not want to pass it. I pressed that before the ball ever got to my hand. That's frustrating. That's real frustrating. Okay. If you just pass to me before half court, that would be a great thing. But you can pro I can promise you they will not pass it to you before half court. Oh my god. He said every NBA player has an elite strength. Some of them have ten of them. And those guys are the very best in the league, right? But every one of them is here for a reason. There are times where you can really soar with that I literally skill. stroked that perfectly. I can't hit anything. I think I've taken like six shots, so I need to cool it down. I've hit one. Unreal. 
trying to go for an alley oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop. Here's Warren. Bucket. And that one there we go. Got another assist. That's a big key. I just want to win. Apparently that's not enough though in this game. You just shoot like 85% and get four steals and six blocks. He's gonna yell at me. He's gonna yell at me at halftime. Let's see what Kyrie has to say. How do you get control of the game back? It starts with not getting the ball out of the net. You know, we, we gotta get stops and uh, it starts in that end. That, that's where it's really gonna start for us. And uh, we just gotta continue to compete. That's all. Kyrie, thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. Well, he's really mastered the non-answer. Gotta get stops and gotta, you know, compete. You know, gotta play basketball. You gotta do the things that are basketball related and and you know, put the ball in the hole and, and, and drive to the Drive to the hoops and the, the balls and the holes. Basketball. Basketball is my favorite sport. I like the way it dribbles up and down the court, so I'm going to pass it over to my friend over there. And that's just what we got to do. I just imagine that somebody would do that sometime. As a broadcaster. I think for me, the hardest skill to learn was to learn how to relax. Okay, come on. Give it to me. Give it to me, mother... I'm having myself. Okay, so I'm one for eight. Holy balls! They're gonna they're gonna sub me out if I keep this crap up. That was a good off-screen three. With a good release, I don't know what they want from me in this game. They do not want me scoring. I can tell you that. At its best, you're a hundred percent correct. On Phoenix, looking who they've got on the floor. T.J. Warren out there with D.J. Then there's Wells. Then there's Budso, and it's Williams at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Five to shoot. It's oh, I blocked it. I'll tell you, defense is about position and anticipation. I got two blocks in this game. Fantastic at both. Back to Budso. Pass to DJ. Looking to get back Post up, right, right in your and face. Yes, Let's go. DJ Let's go. I just got to get a win, and I got to get on a roll. That was beautiful. Post move score. It's that cla classic Kobe turnaround. Fade away. Somebody in his face. Just he missed it. Ugh, oh, Eric's not going to pass to me for a while. There we go. Dishes it to Warren. Now, here's DJ. Off balance. Come on, give me that. Make it. Taking some tough shots here. Taking some tough shots. Not really playing much in the way of like consistent game here. I think I'm two for ten now. Good defense. Again, the miss by Hayward. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Now, here's DJ. He's covered closely. Two inches from the basket, dude. And it's not easy to get those stops at the rim, but he does a great job with it. Yeah, he can make it look simple on the interior when it's really not. He knew exactly how to guard on the inside. Oh, come on. Somebody, yeah, switch for me. More as a screen. Brown outside. Got it off the oh. but it's no good. Two for 11, guys. Two for 11. This has not been the, my game. Offensively, it's not been my game. But I feel like it's going to come on. I'm just trying to get as much many shots up as possible. That's a big key. Get as many shots up as possible. So it's not really a key. It's just something that I'm trying to do because I want to score more. And it's not working. And I can't believe they benched my ass. Now I can because I'm playing like garbage off in general. I felt like last game was a turnaround, though. That was that was me like falling into my starting role. Jesus, I am trash, man. Well, how about Jalen Brown in transition, a phenomenal finisher in the open floor. And that replay brought to us by... Give me that. Oh, my God. I will give them some of these shots were bad.
That was not a bad shot, and it should have gone in. Two for 13. Sometimes I feel like the game is literally fucking with me. He's going to make that, though. The polished mid-range game of Morris. Some of his best shots come from about that 12 to 20 foot range. DJ dishes the land. I can't steal a ball off of him when he's just holding it like that. And apparently, they're going to blame me for that because I went to try to guard the outlet pass. There we go. And one fucking foul with the dunk. That's what I needed. Big time play. Let's go. Only 23% from the field. Who cares? Just keep trying. Keep attacking the rim. Eventually, you're going to get those fouls. We're going to get the buckets. That's the important part. The strength that the Suns have is the length of their front court. Right, Josh Jackson, the rookie, leads the way in Get it. Regard, Eight remember, points. Marquise there we go. At least I'm shooting free throws at 66%. That's pathetic. Develop, oh, God, I'm on Kyrie. I'm scared right now. No wide open shots. Nope, nope. You're shooting... Tw you're you're shooting 54% from the field. I'm, I'm about... I'm cooked. I'm cooked. I'm not fast enough to guard that guy. Oh, but he's guarding me. Okay, this is a clean shot at the rim. That was ridiculous. I was trying to pass it. I don't know how they stripped it. I guess it's Kyrie. He swipes at the ball every time. And apparently they're going to give him that every single time instead of the foul that it most likely is. Oh, my God. I got lucky on that one. There we go. Stroking it on Kyrie. He's too short. He's too small. He's too small. Get him out, coach. Get him out, coach. He can't guard me. I can't guard him, but he can't guard me. Jeez, that was wicked. Okay, so here we go. Breaking it down. Just don't turn the ball over. DJ kicks to Chris. Get it out to Chris. Get, come on, Chris, back to me. I'm going to post him up. Post him up. He's too little. He's too little. He can't guard me. Not in the post. He can't guard me. Another bucket. Can't guard me. Another bucket. He can't guard me. I'm too I'm too big, too strong, too fast. I'm the var ball of shooting. I don't, I'm sorry. That was not a good reference. Oh, God, they should have kicked it to Kyrie right there. Hayward is going shot for shot with me right now. Man, this uh, Boston team would have been scary with Hayward. Would have been real scary with Hayward. That lighting's cool. Okay, let's see if we can uh, keep this up. 12 points, 2 rebounds, 2 assists. Not shooting well. But I got my rhythm in the second half. First half, I couldn't hit the side of the barn. Starting to post up on little guys. They're literally going to take me out at this point. We better have won. Okay, well, that's the end of this game. Uh, I'm not too fond of the coaching decisions. But I do think that I was starting to come to my own right at the end there. And if they had left me in, we would have iced this game no problem. We still won. That's the big thing. I'm going to try to calm down and not be too upset. I was trying to take tough shots. But the problem is... And this is the thing, like you have a badge that's about taking tough shots, right? It's supposed to help you take tough shots. The only way you can get that badge is if you take tough shots or practice. And practice is boring. So I'm just saying like if you're a developer and you're making a game and you're saying, hey, I want people to play my game, maybe I make that badge, maybe not easily attainable, but attainable through different means other than taking tough shots that are unmakeable. If you don't make those shots, you don't get the points. Either way, had a solid game. Hey. Got to keep it up. They do want to talk to me in the studio, though. Sweet. You're going to get to see a little cut to, to the uh, TNT studio. I don't know what they call it. The 2K studio. Oh, he walked right through the camera. Hey, Shaq here. You showed me a lot out there tonight with the way you were able to dominate the glass. Was that something you set out to do? Two rebounds? 
Jack, something that we always talk about in practice and in meetings is how we want to close out possessions on defense. I mean, that is something that we all bought into, and, and it's a goal of ours each time we take the court. So I'm not so much worried about my individual performance on the glass so much as how we rebound as a team. That's a quality Spoken answer. well. You should take Kenny's place. Back to you, Ernie. Ah, <laughs> oh, Shaq, you silly bastard. Great, great, great little moment there. Also, we got a win. We got two wins in a row on recording which is exciting so thank you guys again for tuning in really appreciate all the support uh, make sure to hit that like button again our goal is 110 likes that would be incredible it would be above and beyond amazing and don't forget to comment on the video as well as subscribe to the channel uh, we really appreciate you and as always stay classy go